once upon a time, you had to be rich, titled or privileged to bask in the luxury of an ocean cruise. And it wasn't all that long ago. An outdated image of stuffed shirts and shuffleboards still comes between some of us and a holiday experience that is captivating more and more people every year. People just like you. Cruising today is the fastest growing sector of the holiday market for reasons that cruise enthusiasts will be more than happy to tell you about. Cruise lines have been quick to cater for the demand and you can now choose from a breathtaking variety of ships. A range of fabulous new destinations as well as old favorites such as the Caribbean and Mediterranean have increased both choice and popularity. Modern cruise ships are packed with facilities, so there's plenty to do day or night. Good food and good service are also essential ingredients. In fact, when it comes to cruise holidays, from the moment you're on board, every aspect is designed to ensure total comfort and relaxation. With activities, entertainment, accommodation, and up to 10 meals a day, all included in the price, Cruises offer exceptional value for money. So, just how can you be sure you're picking the right cruise? It's really quite simple. Ask the experts. We'd like to take the next 25 minutes or so to show you a selection of some of the very latest cruise ships available. Lund Poly sells more cruises than any other travel agent. Its exclusive cruise club, designed for frequent cruise customers, boasts more than 25,000 members. And with 800 shops across the UK, as well as a dedicated cruise telephone hotline, Lun Poly are ready and waiting to guide you to the ships, the scenery, and the style of holiday that suits you best. Let's show you what we mean. Hello. Please take a seat. How can I help you? Well, we were thinking about booking a cruise holiday. So when we were in Portugal, we got talking to another couple who'd had a great time on a cruise. And, and we thought we'd like to give it a go, if it's not too expensive, of course. It certainly needn't be expensive. And for cruises, we offer fantastic discounts, which I'll tell you all about later. Oh, you've definitely come to the right place. You sell a lot of cruises, then? More and more each year. It's becoming very popular with all types of people. Does that mean there's lots of choice? Oh, yes. In fact, you really are spoilt for choice. There's a vast range of cruise holidays available. There are a variety of destinations. We have mega ships which hold something like 2,500 passengers, right down to more intimate exclusive ships which hold only 300 passengers. In terms of quality, the ships we offer range from three star to five star and even deluxe, with prices to match, of course. Now then, can I ask you a few questions so we can narrow down exactly what you're looking for and then I can give you our best advice. At Lund Poly, we always try and understand your exact requirements before we recommend a cruise holiday that's just right for you. Right. Now I've got a clearer idea of what you want and where you want to go. Let's start with Carousel. Major tour operators, like Air Tours, are well known for their package holidays, but they're also responding to the rapidly increasing popularity of cruises and have been able to introduce good value, low cost cruising. Many customers want to try the cruise experience for themselves, but also don't want to pay much more than they normally would for their annual holiday. Ships like Carousel offer exactly that with a range of fly cruise holidays to either the Mediterranean or the Caribbean. You can fly out to the ship from a number of UK regional airports. Relaunched in May 1995, Carousel at 23,000 tons can comfortably accommodate up to 1,160 passengers. She has a three-star rating and caters mainly for British customers in a relaxed and informal style. Carousel also offers a range of stay-put options for those customers that may want to combine a cruise with a more conventional resort holiday. I like the sound of this cruising already. What else can you show us? Well, let me tell you about Sapphire, operated by Thompson Holidays. 
It's absolutely perfect for first-time cruisers. Sapphire is another good example of a ship that offers a friendly, informal atmosphere, has a three-star rating, and represents good all-round value at a relatively low price. The ship has been completely refurbished and was relaunched in spring 96. She takes just 650 passengers, all usually British. It's a flexible type of ship being small enough to slip into ports that are off-limits to large ships, yet big enough to offer a full range of entertainment and on-board facilities, including a big tea club for the children. So where would it take us? Sapphire cruises the Mediterranean. Like Carousel, you can fly out to join it from your local airport. And again, you can combine a week's cruising with a week on shore in either Cyprus or Mallorca. They both sound good. The sort of thing we're looking for. They also sound like the sort of thing we're looking for, don't they? They're very nice. Only, well, sometimes it's nice to meet people from other countries, so you know you're really away from home. I know what you mean. In that case, why don't you consider a more international ship that's still a lot of fun, Bolero. Owned and operated by Festival Cruises, Bolero sails around the Mediterranean and the Canaries. But she also offers cruise and stay put options for the Greek islands. The three-star Bolero was refitted and relaunched in October 1995. And although smaller than some cruise ships, still accommodates around 900 guests. Bolero offers good value, friendly service, and the opportunity to be truly European by sharing your time on board with passengers from many other countries. She prides herself on being perfect for the first timer, looking for a different holiday experience, but also attracts experienced cruisers as well. You can fly out of the UK to join Bolero at Venice, her first port of call, making you a mere two hours away from all that Mediterranean sunshine. It looks lovely, but uh, well, I'm not really all that keen on flying, so I was wondering if there was... Um... Anything else you could show us? Yes, of course. You know, if you're not happy about flying, the Southern Cross might be ideal. Operated by CTC Cruises, Southern Cross sails to and from various UK ports, including Tilbury, Greenock and Liverpool. This ship was completely refurbished and relaunched in March 1995, and at over 17,000 tonnes, there's plenty of space for the ship's 750 passengers. This three-star ship offers a full programme of shore excursions. There are cruises to the Mediterranean and the Canaries, or you might want to visit the fabulous Scandinavian fields. In fact, Southern Cross even offers an annual round-the-world cruise. Sailing round the world sounds like one for the future. I think we'll stick to the med for now. Yes, thanks for your help. We'll be back as soon as I've made his mind up. OK, let me give you one of my business cards. Thank you very much. Hello. Good afternoon. How are you today? I'm keeping very busy. How can I help you? I came in here a couple of years ago and booked a cruise holiday for myself and my wife. Where did you go? Did you both enjoy it? Oh, we had a wonderful time. So much so that we're looking to go on another one. So, what are you looking for this time? I was thinking of something more adventurous, a little more challenging. I think I'd like a holiday where we could visit new places, different sort of places. And something that was a little thought-provoking, even educational, maybe. I think I have just exactly what you're looking for. <laughs> Imagine a cruise holiday that combines a great holiday with real intellectual challenge. Swan Hellenic 
have managed to create exactly that. The company has gained an enviable reputation for themed cruises for like-minded people. They are renowned for their archaeological cruises to some of the world's most historic locations. Or you can learn more about history, botany, drama, music. There's plenty to choose from. Swan Hellenic ship is the four-star rated Minerva. Weighing in at just 12,000 tons, Minerva can pop in and out of cozy little harbors that are some of the world's best kept secrets. The ship carries just 300 passengers in surroundings more reminiscent of a country house hotel than a modern cruise ship. The whole experience is relaxed, informal, and truly original. Where else could you be entertained, informed, and still have a truly memorable cruising holiday? If you want more information about a particular port of call, I can contact the tourist board. What do you think? It looks perfect. I'm sure my wife will adore it. I can't wait to tell her all about it. He seemed happy enough. I wonder if you could help us. Well, I'll certainly do my best. What type of holiday are you looking for? We've never been on a cruise before, but we're not ones for lazing around. We like to keep busy. There are so many types of cruise holidays to choose from, and if you want plenty to do, there's no better ship than the Splendour of the Seas. Here, let me show you in the Lumpolly Guide to Cruising. If you're looking for a bustling social scene and plenty to keep you occupied, or just a chance to relax on one of the larger cruise ships, look no further than Splendour of the Seas. This ship is one of a series being built by Royal Caribbean, one of the most respected names in the world of cruising. Perfect for the experienced cruiser or first-timer, this brand new four-star ship was only launched in March 1996. You can step on board at Harwich and sail to the Black Sea, the Mediterranean or even Scandinavia. At 70,000 tons, it has room for 1,800 guests, as well as an 18-hole mini golf course and a state-of-the-art theatre. Nicknamed the Ship of Light for obvious reasons, there's plenty to do day or night. It does seem rather grand. I can think of one problem, though. What would that be? These two. They're ours, unfortunately. Charming. I can just imagine these two running amok and upsetting the other passengers. Well, I wouldn't worry about that too much. Many of the cruise ship holidays are designed with youngsters in mind. There are special kids and teens programmes which are properly supervised to keep them safe, happy and out of your hair. I can guarantee you won't see them from morning till night. But what about food? They're both very fussy eaters. Again, there's nothing to worry about there. The cruise lines specialise in catering for even the fussiest of eaters. I love the idea of having a lot to do on board. What else have you got? Have a look at this. It's one of the world's largest cruise ships. The first 100,000 ton cruise ship, Destiny, is operated by Carnival Cruises. This four-star plus ship has everything, only on a much bigger scale, including enough space for over 2,600 passengers. Destiny is virtually a floating resort with a vast range of facilities, activities and entertainment. She offers an excellent children's program and a lively atmosphere that attracts many American customers. Informal, exciting and just plain big, Destiny guarantees a memorable holiday for one and all. It's certainly very impressive. I like the idea of the bigger ships. Someone recommended a ship called the Oriana? Yes, it is the Oriana. It's a lovely ship with very wide appeal. 
and it's suitable if you're planning a holiday with or without children. My manager's actually been on it. I'll just call her over. Mary, have you got a moment? Possibly no one knows more about cruising than P&O. And the Oriana is a very special ship indeed. Imagine a 200 million pound superliner equipped with the most up-to-date facilities, offering exceptional standards of comfort, service and elegance, and designed in the most classical British tradition. You're thinking of the Oriana. This British atmosphere is no more evident than in the Lord's Taverners Bar, a tribute to all the MCC cricket teams that used to sail P&O to Australia. There's also the elegant Tiffany Court, the Knightsbridge Shopping Centre and the 660-seater Theatre Royal. The Oriana is literally a floating world-class hotel and at 69,000 tonnes and carrying just under 2,000 passengers, there's plenty of room to make the most of all the facilities on offer. The Oriana sails from Southampton to several destinations or you can fly out to join her at more distant ports. For example, you can take in part of her annual world cruise or tour the Mediterranean, the Caribbean, Madeira and the Canaries, the Baltic and Scandinavia. You're almost spoiled for choice. The Oriana virtually guarantees a cruise holiday that you'll never forget. Oh, it's a fabulous ship. Oh, hello again. It's Mr and Mrs Russell, isn't it? Nice to see you again. Hello. hello. How was your last holiday? Oh, it was wonderful. We thoroughly enjoyed it. We want to book another cruise, only this time it's for a very special celebration. Yes, it's our silver wedding anniversary, so this time we really want to push the boat out, if you'll excuse the pun. Congratulations. Tell me, have you got anything particular in mind? After all, you've been on quite a few cruises. We were actually thinking of the Oriana again. Or the other contender is the QE2. It's a ship I've always dreamed about. Well, the QE2 is certainly a beautiful ship with an awful lot of history behind her. Probably the world's most famous vessel and flagship of the Cunard line, the QE2. Modelled in the grand tradition of the blue ribbon transatlantic liners of the golden years, but with modern facilities, the QE2 is the embodiment of grandeur and elegance. She was relaunched in October 1994, following a £30 million refit. There are 13 decks and 963 cabins, ranging from single cabins to penthouse suites. Three distinct classes allow you to select the best option to suit your pocket. There are no fewer than five fabulous restaurants, and there's even a branch of Harrods for that extra special souvenir. This stunning ship visits the Mediterranean, the Caribbean and Alaska, and even offers a round-the-world cruise. Passengers can choose to combine a transatlantic crossing with the additional thrill of a supersonic flight in Concorde. How better to enjoy the excitement of New York, the elegant glamour of cruising across the Atlantic, and the tradition and heritage of Cunard's finest ship. I'm sure it would be the holiday of a lifetime. Oh, decisions, decisions. I'll tell you what, we'll pop out for a cup of coffee and discuss it. And then we'll come back later and sort out some details. OK, then. But don't leave it too long if you want a particular date for your anniversary. Oh, don't worry, I won't. Hello. Can I help you? Yes, I hope so. We want to book a cruise holiday. And what sort of thing are you looking for? Well, we've been on a couple of cruise holidays before and we had a wonderful time, but we were looking for something a little special. Both of our kids are now at university, so we've got the time to take a longer holiday. We were thinking of a really top-of-the-range ship or maybe a different destination somewhere like uh, Alaska. If you're thinking of going to Alaska, let me show you Sun Princess.
Sun Princess and its sister ship, Dawn Princess, are operated by Princess Cruises, part of the P&O company. At 77,000 tons, Sun Princess is also one of the world's largest cruise ships. Able to accommodate some 2,000 passengers, the ship blends tasteful decor and high-quality service and cuisine, lavish entertainment and great sporting facilities. A spectacular atrium forms the ship's centerpiece, and its style and atmosphere attracts a truly cosmopolitan clientele from both the old and new worlds. On board Sun Princess, you can cruise the Caribbean or the western seaboard of Canada, as far north as the breathtaking scenery of Alaska. Now that sounds fabulous. I love the sound of cruising off the Alaskan coast. Well, I like the sound of soaking up some sun in the Caribbean. Let's see if I can keep you both happy. Let me tell you about some specialist Caribbean cruises. Celebrity Cruises is a company that specializes in Caribbean cruises. Their flagship is called Century. This five-star ship sails to both the Western and Eastern Caribbean islands. This 70,000-ton ship boasts five-star cruising at four-star prices. Launched in December 95, the ship is the length of three football pitches. So it's no surprise that space is abundant everywhere you look. The superb theatre offers spectacular shows every night, and an impressive array of public rooms and facilities is available for all to enjoy. Along with an excellent reputation for fine cuisine and attentive service, Century offers great value and a truly relaxing holiday. Now that looks perfect. Really relaxing. <laughs> OK, I give in. Alaska will have to be next year. But if we're going to the Caribbean, I'd like something really sophisticated and elegant. If that's what you're looking for, let me show you the Holland America brochure. Beendam, one of Holland America's latest ships, is a 52,000 ton four-star plus ship suited to more experienced cruisers. Sailing the Caribbean, Beendam prides herself on offering the very highest standards and levels of service and a no tipping necessary policy adds greater value and a warmer welcome. Tradition, quality and elegance are all associated with Beendam. There's an atmosphere reminiscent of more gentle times when the world seemed to move at a much slower pace. The Rotterdam dining room offers magnificent ocean views and the ship's interior is decorated with antiques and fine art. These treasures are a key feature of Veendam, so much so that the ship offers guided tours to fully explain their value and history. looks lovely. I think we'll have to start having more holidays, John. <laughs> yes, it's a fantastic ship. But tell me, is there anything even more exclusive? If you're looking for something right at the top of the range, take a look at this. Silver Sea operates two of the world's most exclusive ships, Silver Cloud and Silver Wind. At nearly 17,000 tons, they're not exactly small, but each ship restricts itself to taking a mere 296 very privileged passengers. Every cabin is a spacious, beautifully fitted suite, and each and every one has a view of the sea. The ship is superbly finished, with elegant decor and fine furnishings, and with a ratio of two staff to every passenger, service is naturally of the very highest quality. There's plenty of space if you want some peace and quiet, and the holidays are sold as exclusive and all-inclusive, so everything is costed into the price, even including drinks and tips. Silver Sea offers a choice of cruises to the Mediterranean, the Caribbean, and even sails along the spectacular rivers of the South American rainforests. You can visit the Far East or the Indian Ocean, 
or close to home, enjoy a cruise around Britain or a trip to the Baltic. These five-star rated ships are really the very last word in luxury. But, as you'd expect, they also come with a price tag to match. Well, talk about spoil for choice. That last ship looks absolutely marvellous. I think we're going to have to give them all some serious consideration. But one thing's certain, you've been so helpful, we'll definitely be back to book with you. OK, I've got your name and number, so I'll give you a call next week and see what you've decided. Lovely. I'll speak to you soon. I'll just see you to the door. Right. If you need any more information, brochures, or just straightforward advice, you can call into any Lund Poly shop or telephone the Lund Poly Cruise hotline number that you'll see at the end of this video. At Lund Poly, we pride ourselves as being the cruise experts, and we're happy to prove it time and time again. We have the widest selection of cruise holidays, and our experienced sales consultants will always recommend the right one just for you. Book with Lund Poly and you'll get impartial advice, friendly service, unbeatable discounts and free automatic membership of our exclusive cruise club. There are many good reasons why more and more people are choosing cruise ship holidays. After all, what could be more relaxing or more enjoyable? Beautiful places, beautiful scenery and beautiful ships. Why not give cruising a try? The Lund Poly way. Thank you.